Jack Nicholson, he does this exercise. He did it for years in an acting class, and he still does it. Why? Because he says it centers him. He still does it. He says, I can tell what kind of an actor somebody is through the song exercise. You are in charge of your body. You know if your body is relaxed. And you look, as I'm looking at the camera, you look as if the camera is a person, and you begin to sing a song. Holding the notes of a song as steady as possible while you're looking at the audience, which at some point will make you very aware of impulses that you're having. One of the things that's uh, difficult to train in acting is the follow, first the recognition of one's own impulses and then the allowing one of oneself to follow those impulses. It's, it's kind of a two-part process. Uh, what happens is you get very tense and you're not even aware that you have impulses because you, you just choke them off with tension. Um, once you can learn to move your focus from inside to outside, it's the start of real behavior and acting. And then you move on to each, to different phases in the class. And whatever they give you, or whatever you feel they're giving you, that you somehow allow that to come into the exercise. So you're doing row, and you elongate the breath of it. Row, and you're not trying to act, you're just allowing whatever you're getting the feelings you're getting from each person you're looking at to affect you. Because of life, we get into bad habits, you know? It depends on what happens to us in life. When, you, when you're a child, uh, you have ex excellent impulses, uh, you laugh, you cry, you scream, you play games, you play cops and robbers, you believe everything. So as you get older, you start losing all your impulses because you have to adjust to society. And then suddenly you want to go into acting, and what happens is that you're so used to not expressing how you really feel because everybody says, don't cry, don't scream, be nice, you hold everything back. You have to break the conditioning. The conditioning is very, very strong. Like, ha <laughs> Like that. If something made you laugh, you, you laughed. You always took it from, from the people in the class. And the other thing he would do is make sure that you're, that you were aware of your body. So in other words, he would say, uh, you, your, your shoulder might go like that, or you might tilt your body this way. You have to be relaxed. All the time. Right? And if you're not relaxed while you're doing a song exercise, be aware of where you feel you're not relaxed, and will that area to relax. Relax, if it's in your neck, là. will your neck to relax? Si cou, if it's around tête. your lips, will your si lips to relax? If it's your arms, will your si arms to relax? Yes? As you're doing the song exercise. If you catch yourself moving during si the song exercise, be aware of it. Then, <coughs> will yourself Alors, to stop moving. He would always make you aware of your physical body first as a part of relaxing so that you know you you can make the choice to move your hand over here you do that not your nervousness you don't make a movement that you don't want to make like i'm doing right now après ce qui est dur c'est d'avoir un regard extérieur sur soi et ça c'est nécessaire et c'est pour ça que de refaire des stages de recontourner de travailler avec un ami the song exercise has all the elements of acting. Yes, you stay in contact. The only thing that moves is your head, right? Choose a song, break it up into syllables. For example, let's say I do happy birthday, right? You want a full committed sound. Like this. From, the, from, from here. From the guts. 
vente des tripes. Ha, and hold it long. Ah, Abby Bird fait ah, une uh, longue. Animal sound. Avec un son animal. Then you make a pause. Tu fais une pause. Right? Take your time. In the pause, you really check your relaxation. What am I feeling? And also, am I feeling anything? If you're angry, let's say you're angry, let's say, be in touch with that. And give yourself an honest reason why you're angry. Don't tell us, you do it. By doing that, you get in touch with your feelings. Tu rentres en contact avec ce que tu ressens à l'intérieur, avec tes émotions. You pause in between syllables. Tu fais des pauses entre chaque syllabe. Take a nice relaxed breath. Tu prends une respiration bien décontractée. Then make the next syllable. Tu fais la syllabe suivante. Yes, you take your time. Tu prends ton temps. You look. Tu regardes toujours les gens dans les yeux. That's the structure. Ça, c'est la structure de l'exercice. Right? That's like the scene. C'est comme de jouer une scène. These are obstacles. You have to face the audience. Tu dois faire face au public. See? Look at them. Regarde-les. They're real and you're real. Ils sont réels et tu es réel. You can't hide behind tu anything here. Tu ne peux pas te cacher derrière rien. There's no character to hide behind. There's no mask to hide behind. Tu ne peux pas te cacher. Il n'y a pas de masque que tu peux porter. You should be naked. Tu dois être à nu. Naked. À nu. It's you and me. C'est toi et moi. You're real and I'm real. Vous êtes réel, je suis réel. That's how you should act, by the way. C'est comme ça que vous devriez jouer. Devant 50 personnes, qui est dans, la, dans le cours de théâtre, vous ne devez pas bouger. Donc vous avez des bouffées de chaleur qui montent comme ça, parce que d'un seul coup, vous êtes à nu, vous avez de votre vie qui passe devant vous. Vous êtes, vous, vous dites, putain, je suis pas bien, je suis mauvais, ou, ou alors vous vous dites, putain, qu'est-ce que pensent les gens de moi, ils me connaissent, et tout ça. Et vous pouvez pas bouger, c'est une horreur. C'est basique ce que je dis, parce que c'est vraiment un exercice trop complexe, j'ai même du mal à l'expliquer. If you tighten the body, you're stopping the emotion. And I think that's, I think that's correct. So sometimes he would come behind us and he would, and I'm sure Jack does this probably, he would hold our arms out while we're doing the exercise. We're supposed to be completely relaxed, so we'd be like this. So he holds our arm out, we're going row, row, and then he takes his arms away from holding out and we're still here, <laughs> see? And we've seen this in class. That means we, as the actor, are unaware of our own tension. And that, I thought, was a magnificent exercise because he said, why are you holding your arms out? And you weren't aware of it, and you let him go. Because as we know in life, that suppresses emotion. Keep going, keep going. <laughs> keep going, make sure. <laughs> Take a breath. Within that structure, you have to go moment to moment. If you feel something from someone, yes, you have to be aware of it. You have to say to yourself, what am I feeling? I'm frightened. Be in touch with it. At the same time, you have to stay in contact with the people. Ha, 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 ha.